In this tutorial, we will show how to raise FPP claim, how to declare FDT, and how to view the FPP related report. Once you log into the ESS portal, if your company has opted for FBP declaration, you will be able to view the FBP option under this menu. If you click on this FBP, you will be able to see various options related to FBP. First, you have to declare the FBP declaration. Then only you will be able to raise every month FBP claims. To declare the same, you have to click on FBP declaration. Based on your company policy, the FBP components will reflect here. First, you have to click on save and then you have to click on submit. Once submitted, your FPP declaration will get locked. To redeclare, you have to request your HRR concern admin to unlock the same. Next, to raise a new FPP claim, you have to go to this FPP claim. You can choose a component. You can enter the description, enter the particulars, bill number, date, the requested amount. If you want to upload the bills, you can use this attachment icon. You can browse and upload the bills. If you want to add one more claim, you can click on this plus icon. Then you can enter the respective details once entered all the claims finally you have to click on apply it will go to the concern admin person once admin person has approved then you will get that amount in that particular month payroll once submitted it will take you directly to the fbp claims history where you can view the claim submitted so far it will show you the claim raise date process month pay type the component and bill submitted approved amount the status if you want to export this to excel sheet you can click on this export to excel where you can view the details of the claim space next if you want to view the approved bills so far you can check under this fbp bill submission report and select a particular month whatever the bills approved and paid in that particular month you will able to view here if you want to take a print of this you can click on this print you will get a pdf document of the same if you want a detailed report on what is the availed and what is the eligibility balance everything then you can able to view the same under this view detail benefit report component wise it will show the standard eligibility if component is attendance based based on the number of days work that will get prorate and it will show the attendance based eligibility bills submitted so far bills approved if there is any rejection amount that will reflect here whatever the amount availed till date you will be able to view under this availed till date any bills carry forward that will reflect under this bills carry forward and that final eligibility balance component wise if you want to explain Export this to Excel sheet. You can click this Excel export. Same thing you will get in an Excel sheet. And if you want to download FPP monthly report for the entire financial year, you can click on this FPP download monthly report. You will get an Excel sheet for the entire financial year, month wise, eligibility amount for each component, bill submitted, approved amounts, availed. There is any carry forward that will reflect here. Then balance. This is month wise. entire report you will able to download in fbp monthly report this is about flexible benefit plans in ess portal thank you for watching this video